my name is Tom Gamow. I specialize in transformation and delivery roles. So project managers, business analysts, change managers, and agile delivery specialists. It's quieter than it has been for a while. It seems like there are more uh, large capital expenditure projects uh, being delivered and seen out and, and less projects actually starting at the moment. With the change of government at the end of last year, rising interest rates, there's been a lot more kind of caution from companies, willingness to kick off new capital expenditure projects. Uh, so we're just seeing uh, more projects that are already in flight being seen through to completion. What we are hearing from customers is that they have got budget that they're looking at. They've got initiatives that they need to complete at the same time, having to look at their core operational structure. And in some cases, downsize that to suit the uh, now slightly smaller market in New Zealand. We've definitely seen a trend for bigger clients to try and hire more permanent staff into their kind of business change transformation teams. That's partly because when the market was at its highest, they were actually using contractors for core business as usual roles. They're now trying to fill those business as usual roles permanently. Now there's more people available on the market. However, there are still contract roles for genuine transformation and, and contract based projects. Um, we're still seeing the usual project managers, senior project managers, business analysts, etc. However, it's just a, a smaller volume. Clients are being a bit more selective and exact in terms of the kind of skills and experience that they're looking for as they know that there's there's more people available on the market so we're finding for instance with project managers and business analysts they're looking for bas who have specific experience of products uh, erp systems or particular business areas and lines of business flexibility is key where it, because the market is that now um, an employer's market rather than a candidate's market employers are uh, looking for candidates who can offer some flexibility. So I think that whilst clients are still offering flexibility, they know we're all human and we've got lives, there is a definite push to having people in the office more. Uh, so typically, you, you know, remote working was available or, you know, even two days a week in the office, three days a week is standard now. Um, and we are seeing some companies move to four days a week and not just companies as a whole, but if there are particular programs or, or initiatives that are, are quite time short and intensive, then that program as a whole will put their own charter together and uh, commit to four days a week in the office.